Okay, so let's start off with Kyle Rittenhouse. Because we all know how much you love Kyle Rittenhouse. The men that were shot by Kyle Rittenhouse, the judge has decided they can't be called victims. No. The two dead guys can't be called victims. Neither can the man that survived. But they can be called rioters and looters. I'm not playing, man. That's that's how horrible our judicial system is. Yeah, they wouldn't want to taint the jury by calling the dead people victims. But somehow the jury won't be tainted by calling the dead people rioters and looters. A Wisconsin judge ruled Monday that attorneys in the Kyle Rittenhouse case, the murder trial, referred to the men the teen shot in Kenosha, Wisconsin last year as rioters, looters, and arsonists. I forgot one. Arsonists as well. They could not, however, describe uh, Joseph Rosenbaum and Anthony Huber, who were both killed, engaged Gross Kruitz, who was wounded, as victims. Because the term was loaded language, says the judge. The ruling comes ahead of what's expected to be a contentious trial. As we know, Kyle Rittenhouse at the age of 17 went to Kenosha, Washington on August 25th, 2020 with an AR-15 style weapon, a rifle. He crossed state lines during the turmoil sparked by the shooting of Jacob Blake. And he went there to maintain the peace, you know. He went there to, you know, because other people's businesses, and, you know, he wanted to be there to, you know, support those people. Not by, like, cleaning up if there was damage or helping rebuild or patch up windows if there was a problem, but to walk around with his gun. I guess he wasn't looking for trouble. He was just walking around with his gun. Circuit Judge Bruce Schroeder laid out final ground rules before the trial next week. Rittenhouse faces homicide charges in the death of Rosenbaum, uh, Rosenbaum 36, Huber, 26, and an attempted homicide charge for shooting Groseritz, Groskritz, 27. He's also charged with being a minor in possession of a firearm. Rittenhouse has pled not guilty to all charges, and his attorney are expected to argue he acted in self-defense. Schroeder said that while he advised Rittenhouse's team against using pejorative terms, he described the three men shot with such language could be used in their closing arguments. So, like, don't go through the whole trial calling them rioters and arsonists. Just when you're making your final plea, that's when you can, like, you know, call them rioters, arsonists, and looters. Yeah, just in the closing arguments. Up to then, just call them their names. Dead person and other dead person whom my client killed. That's what you should call him. Man, I'm telling you. He goes, here's the judge's, here's his actual quote. He says, the word victim is a loaded, loaded word. The alleged victim is a cousin to it. The alleged victim. Although such rulings are not uncommon in trials in which there is a dispute over self-defense, prosecutors suggest the judge was employing a double standard by allowing Rosenbaum, Huber, and Groskowitz to be called rioters, looters, and arsonists, but not victims. In particular, could be so disparaged given they would never have had a chance to defend themselves. So, yeah, like, can the prosecutors call Rittenhouse a killer or a murderer? Like, I'm just wondering if it works both ways. I mean, he did kill two people. The defense is expected to argue that the three men posed a danger on the night of the, the team shot them. The focus of its argument is, is expected to be on Rosenbaum, who Rittenhouse defense has suggested participated in arson and threatened to kill people. Yeah, I saw him playing with matches, so I had to shoot him. Yeah. Damn it, I should have labeled it. Here we go. So according to the judge, these guys are not cops. These guys are not a problem. But the other people that you see without guns out, those are the scary people. Yep. 
the defense is expected to argue that the three men posed a danger, but Kyle didn't. Kyle was not dangerous. That's right. He's not dangerous. Because they love their militia, they love they 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 hate the, they hate they hate protesters, and uh, they're gonna defend this kid. And look, let me be clear, man. Obviously, I think Kyle Rittenhouse should have to pay for his crime. Obviously, um, and I think cops should do police work, and not kids. But I also want to make it clear that I think that. His family failed him a long time ago. I mean, Kyle Rittenhouse, his family knew what kind of shenanigans their son partakes in, and they had something to do with this. Like, everyone who knew Kyle Rittenhouse was going down here to Kenosha with an AR-15-style rifle. We thought he was going to do some police protection work or whatever. All of them should be held accountable. Not just Kyle Rittenhouse. He was 17 years old. His brain ain't fully formed. So I I would like to just remind everyone, all the folks who are all the folks who are weighing in on this, and I know how upset you are, I'm upset too. I mean, it's all right because it's all white. This is a white on white crime. Uh Uh-oh, a white on white crime. But let's not go so far as not to recognize that this whole this is all shit, okay? He's a kid. Who raised this kid to be this way? Who let this kid be this way? What's in this kid's head that he thinks, hey, let me go take a gun and, and save the day at a place, as far as I know, no one else died except the people he killed. So how dangerous was it? Did the, other, did the people that he killed kill other people? Who, who else did they kill? See, the only people that were really hurt that night were people that crossed paths with Kyle Rittenhouse because he's walking around with a fucking AR-15 intimidating people, acting like he's the popo. He's not the popo. He's the Waco. That's where we're at, guys. All right? Of course, I'll keep you up to date on this story because it's interesting to me what's going to happen here. Unlike some who want to recruit the followers of Kyle Rittenhouse, I don't want to make them my audience. I want them to understand that this is not the way to go.